hey guys welcome back to my channel so in this video i'll be telling you about the five unaccredited courses that the walter sisulu university is offering according to blade nzimande so this is based on an article that was written by times live on the 28th of may and if you remember back in april um more than a dozen qualifications at WUSU were called into question following media reports that they were unaccredited. And then um, the Council on Higher Education, it cleared some of the qualifications. However, on Friday, Blade and Zimande was asked in Parliament by a DA member of Parliament, Chantel King. Um, Chantel King asked... Um, you know, Blade and Zamande about the accreditation of the Walter Sisulu University courses. And he did say, Blade and Zamande revealed that five courses offered by Walter Sisulu University are unaccredited. So these five courses are um, the Advanced Diploma in Internal Auditing, Advanced Diploma in Journalism, BSc Honors in Zoology, Master of Medicine in Obstetrics and Gynecology, and the Postgraduate Diploma in Chemical Pathology. So these five courses are unaccredited. So if you know anyone who wants to study any of these five courses, just <laughs> make them watch this video, send them the article. I've left the link to the article in the description box. So I really, I feel like my two cents is that like we need to to do better as a country um, because we go to these universities trusting that everything is above and it's you know it agrees with the law so um just do your own research if things like this are coming out about universities that we go to and universities that we've trusted for a long time i think it's very important to say that people must um Check out, check out if the course that you want to apply for at a specific university is accredited or not. And I don't know where the smoke this fire because initially it was like a dozen, a dozen, which is like 12 courses were rumored to be unaccredited. And now Blade and Zamande is actually saying and confirming that five courses are unaccredited. So I don't know what has to happen to the university if they are found to be, you know, offering unaccredited courses. Something has to be done because it's so much admin um, applying for a course, checking whether the school and the course that they're offering, is it accredited or not? It's just a lot of admin. So um, the, the article goes on to say the five courses fall within this category and should be in teach out until new replacement programs are accredited or registered. So these courses should be phased out or removed and basically canceled because they're not accredited. Um, but they say that WUSU registered students for the courses after the cutoff date, Nzimande said, he said the postgraduate diploma in library and information services, which also has legacy roots, had not been offered since 2019. And the Council for Higher Education had recommended the appointment of an evaluator to review um, the alignment processes for the five courses. So a report still needs to be done and the courses still need to be evaluated. But as of this moment, they are unaccredited. Um, so it's it's just, it's a lot of things. Um, a data validation project project is underway by the Council of Higher Education, which is intended to validate the HEQSF, don't know what that means, alignment data to ensure the accreditation record at the Council for Higher Education is an accurate reflection of what the institutions can offer. If or when discrepancies are identified, the Council of Higher Education will deal with them in a similar manner to the processes described above. So there you have it. Um, so just just be on the lookout of, you know, for those five courses, and yeah, do your own <laughs> do your own checking to see whether the courses that you have applied to applied for at certain universities are accredited or not. So yeah, this is like my first like official video where I do 
this kind of thing. And um, I hope it reaches the right people and it raises awareness, you know, to check whether your course is accredited or not. And accreditation is like a really, really important thing because you don't want to study and then find out that your course is not accredited. Because as much as we can say that the university will give you your degree or your diploma, employers are very picky and you know, the university is not the one hiring you. you. You have to worry about other people, you know, the employer. So this kind of thing is, it's not on. So I hope from this video, you take away that these five courses are currently unaccredited and you should do your own accreditation check in the future. Thank you for joining my live. I had like four people who joined my live. So... <laughs> And whenever you see this video, just read the article in the description box below. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Bye.